Hello to those kids, I'm Sofia bienvenue to Canal. So this is an exciting video for me because I gave myself a little allowance and allowed myself to buy all new hair care products, stuff I never tried before, stuff that I've been researching, and actually some stuff that you guys suggested that I try. So this is going to be a little heat train hair product haul. I don't have that much, but as time progresses and I begin to make a little bit more money with YouTube, I'm definitely going to invest more money into purchasing more products and trying them out. So, bueno, vamos a decir, pero vamos a empezar. So, I went to my beauty supply store and picked up quite a few things. I was in there for at least an hour. And actually, this beauty supply store I had never been to before. It was really small, but it had almost everything that I was looking for. The main thing I knew I wanted to get was the Afog protein treatment, which I actually just filmed a video on, so make sure you check that out to see my results from it. But it's supposed to stop hair breakage and rebuilds the hair structure for up to six weeks. So uh, I have a little bit more detail in that video. I don't want to give you guys too much in this video. Go check out that video if you want to see my thoughts about this stuff. And right next to that, I saw the Afog Keratin and Green Tea Reconstructorizer. How do you say that? And this is supposed to strengthen instantly, builds body, protects color, and chemical services. And after you shampoo your hair, you're supposed to spray a liberal amount on to towel dried hair, comb through gently with a wide tooth comb, style as usual, and it says heat helps to lock in the treatment. And when I saw that heat is used to lock in the treatment, I felt like this was really good for me to try because I'm always putting heat on my hair. And it says that I can use this regularly because at first I was a little nervous. I'm like, is this a keratin treatment? But probably not. But uh, I'm definitely super excited to try this out. I probably should have tried it out when I tried my Afro G little treatment, but I just didn't want to mix too many products because that stuff primarily says it's supposed to be used by a professional, which I didn't know. So I just didn't want to take it into my own hands and just start doing my own little thing and then my hair ended up falling out. But anyway, I wanted to try the Afro G Keratin Green Tea Reconstructorizer. I wanted to get products that's going to begin to help with not only growing out my hair but also helping to stop my hair breakage because if you guys have seen my past couple of videos I've been struggling with hair breakage due to what I think is my vitamins. So the next thing I decided to try was the Mazzani Therma Smooth Conditioner and because I love Mazzani's cream that I use to moisturize my hair on a daily basis I figured why haven't I tried their shampoos or their conditioners anything like that. So because this is from the Therma Smooth collection it's supposed to help with people specifically who use heat to style their hair and it also has some coconut infused in here so I'm really excited to try it. I didn't even smell the product. Oh my gosh it smells amazing. I didn't even think to smell the product and I'm probably just saying that because I just used the Afro G protein treatment and that smelled like straight up rotten eggs and the conditioner smelled like uh, Lysol. I, it was just a weird smell. And also from Mazzani, I got the 25 Miracle Milk. It is a leave-in conditioner and I like this one because it was all nice and milky. I didn't smell this one either, but let me see. So it definitely has some scent in there. It doesn't stink for sure. It has like a nice little soft smell and it lists 25 benefits that comes from this bottle. I'll just list a couple of the things. I won't list all 25. Controls flyaways, reduces dryness, helps to condition transitioning hair, adds smoothness, helps prevent heat damage, helps prevent split ends, helps seal the cuticle, and then when you apply it, you apply it to damp hair, comb thoroughly, and you go ahead and style your hair as usual. I'm really excited to try this. I haven't had a leave-in conditioner in a minute. You guys know I love It's a 10, but I just want to try something different because this haul is about trying new products for my hair. The next thing I got was a sample pack, which is what I probably should have did for a couple of these things, and that way I could have bought more. I actually used the Hair Fertilizer by ORS, and this is the Hair Mayonnaise with Nettle Leaf and Horsetail Extract. So I actually, drink nettle leaf tea and it's supposed to cleanse out your blood and really help with healing your skin and just all a lot of parts of the body so i didn't realize that you can put nettle leaf in your hair this is for damaged and weak hair infused with nettle leaf and horsetail to nourish while olive oil egg protein and wheat germ oil help to restore damaged and depleted hair so the next time i do uh, my deep conditioning treatment which will probably be a week and a half or two weeks i am going to 
try this to see if I notice a difference. I probably should have bought two packs because, and I might actually just go back and buy another pack because I'm very heavy handed with my products and I don't think this is going to be enough for all of my hair. So the next few things I got was actually from the health food store right across the street from the beauty supply. And that is peppermint oil and tea tree oil. I've actually started using this this past week and they are strong and I am very heavy handed with my products and I have to be very very careful with these because my scalp started feeling a little sore after using this for like three or four days and just putting 10 drops at a time of each product. You can't do that with this. But I'm very excited to have this help with stimulating my hair growth and working on getting a hair steamer which I am so excited about. I will hopefully have that by the end of this month and I am actually going to try to put some of these oils in the hair steamer. I'm going to see if I can even do that and let uh, that steam be mixed with the oils and see how that infuses with my hair. But I got these two things to help with stimulating hair growth. I also ended up picking up some more vitamin E oil. I have been using it for my skin for the past couple months and I really really like how it is on my skin. It gives my skin this really really nice glow without making it look greasy. So the reason I had tried this oil on my hair is because I ran out of all my other oils and then I did some research and was just like can I use vitamin E oil on the hair and I heard a lot of good responses from it and I know how much I loved it for my skin it leaves my skin feeling really moisturized looks very hydrated without it looking greasy so um, once I put it on my hair it became my new favorite oil right next to avocado oil so vitamin E oil is actually really really amazing for your hair and I actually just ordered these two products from Amazon because the prices was pretty much the same as if I was to go to Target but because my sister has Amazon Prime and I've been using her account, I didn't have to pay for shipping. And it's going to get here super quick. So the first thing I got was the Natural Nibs and Honey Ultimate Growth Serum. And what made me fall in love with Camille Rose is that she uses all natural products. So I definitely feel like I'm going to slowly transition into a lot of her products. But this particular serum has virgin alma oil, virgin sesame seed oil, virgin coconut oil, golden jojoba oils, virgin olive oil, pressed macadamia oils, and a couple of other oils. I just I can't figure out how to say the name of and it has some tea tree oil in here. But anyway, I am so excited to try this and I'm really hoping this is going to help to stimulate some hair growth for me. But even if it doesn't, I know that this product is going to be magnificent with helping me to create and maintain healthy hair. And the second thing I got from Camille Rose was the Algae Renew Deep Conditioning Mask. And I've been on the hunt for a deep conditioner, like a really good one for a minute. And it says it's designed to stop breakage, strengthen hair fibers, promote growth. Blue green algae is composed of 50 to 71 percent protein along with all the major amino acids. I do just have to be careful with how much protein and keratin I'm putting in my hair because I don't want it to get too strong too hard because then it's going to start to break off. But I went on here's my little heat train hair haul. Let me know if you've tried any of these products and then what my next haul video should include which I'll probably do in about a month or two of all new products to try. Y bueno, es todo lo que quiero decir. Ya se ve el próximo. I want to thank me for doing all this hard work. 